Hey everyone, so I've been using this Omtec Pronto 45 for hundreds of hours and honestly, I should have upgraded way sooner. This thing has literally paid for itself three times over and I'm about to show you exactly why this might be the best laser cutter upgrade you'll ever make. I'm not new to laser cutting, I've been doing this for years. I started with a Glowforge and used high-end epilogues at my college makerspace. Then I moved to a Boss LS1416, but here's the thing, my Boss was kind of cramping my style. Uh, same price point as the Omtech, but way smaller work area and only 80 watts. I was constantly fighting with space limitations and it was costing me money. Look, I'll be straight with you. I generate hundreds of thousands of dollars using laser cutters. So when I say this machine paid for itself three times over, that's real money we're talking about. The Pronto 45 gave me everything I was missing, a massive work area, 100 watts of pure cutting power and features that just make sense for the production work. This 100 watt tube is an absolute beast. I'm cutting three millimeter Baltic birch at 30 millimeters per second at just 70% power. That's lightning fast compared to what I was doing before. When you're running production jobs, that speed translates directly to profit. The work area on this thing is incredible. We're talking about accommodating pieces 24 by 40 inches, uh, which is a huge increase over typical machines. No more turning down jobs because they won't fit. Now I'll admit I was skeptical about the autofocus at first. I'm kind of old school. I like having control over everything, but the non-contact autofocus system is genuinely fantastic. It's precise, it's fast, and it eliminates one of those tedious setup steps that slow down production. The engineering on this machine is solid. We've got a V-wheel design on the X-axis for smooth movement, high precision belts on the Y-axis, and a ball screw system on the Z-axis that's both stable and quiet. The upgraded uh, transmission system delivers cleaner cuts and more accurate engraves every time. Now, if I'm being completely honest, there's a tiny thing I missed from my boss. The laser head assembly on the boss was slightly easier to access for lens cleaning. It's a minor thing, really nitpicky, but when you're maintaining equipment regularly, those little details matter. That said, it's a trade-off I'll make any day for everything else this machine delivers. The only other thing I would upgrade with this machine is the exhaust fan. Uh, the one they send you is adequate to start, but over time I would recommend upgrading to something a little better. Here's the bottom line. If you're trying to make money with a laser cutter, the Pronto series is designed for that. 1000 millimeters per second engraving speed, which means you can handle high volume production work. The larger work area means you can take on bigger projects. The reliability means less downtime. All of that adds up to more profit in your pocket. And Omtech's support has been solid. They've got over 50 demo rooms across the US if you want to see one in person. Plus their US-based customer support team actually knows what they're talking about. Here's something exciting. I loved this machine so much that I actually partnered with Omtech. That means if you're ready to upgrade your laser game, you can use my code, Pardesco5, to get an additional 5% off any series machine that's on top of whatever deals they're already running but before you buy anything head over to my website pardesco.com i've got some uh, blog posts over there comparing all the different models plus a free startup guide that'll help you avoid mistakes i made when starting out the link will be down in the video description Look, I don't partner with companies I don't believe in. This machine has been a game changer for my business. And if you're serious about laser cutting, whether you're just starting out or looking to upgrade, the Pronto series deserves your consideration. Use code PARDESCO5. Check out that blog post and let me know what comments you have, what projects you're doing. I'd love to see what you all create. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one.